your girl you know got a new camera and think I'm back and better and that's how I'm feeling right now. It's Desi here. Welcome back to my YouTube channel where I share fashion beauty tips for all the baddies in the 20s So before we get into it join the delight club and club delight is lit you Go ahead and subscribe to this channel like comment and share so that way you can you you too can secure your spot today's video We are discussing what I am excited to wear this spring and we are here for fashion wardrobe gossip Let's go as we are transitioning into warmer weather, I am so particularly excited about bringing back shorts, skirts, shorter length bottoms, rompers. We're excited to bring them back. We got a special guest. Boots, boots, boots. The best way to transition is pairing shorter lengths with boots. These are fire for the day and for the night. I am so particularly excited about wearing corset tops and because they really go crazy, they go crazy. They're literally an instant mood booster like this one. I actually thrifted, actually I thrifted both of them, but this one in particular got the little beads on the bottom. The designs are nice in the back. Look at the back. All, all throughout the back. So just in case my body changes, I can just, I can adjust the back. Now for me, I got the black one and one thing about me, I'm gonna use what I got and I just use scraps of fabric as little ribbon. Has the adjustable back as well. Got the nice little V and this one is in a Elizabethan style because it has a little V on the bottom and that's one detail I really particularly like about these corset tops. Next thing I'm really excited about, not just spring, bright colors, nice prints, full prints. I'm excited about the sundresses, okay? The sundress I'm excited about. This nice full print, this one is a lighter weight fabric. This one is actually a tinsel and this one is from Never Fully Dressed. They do go all the way up to in the 20s. This one is in a US 10, this one I believe is a large and I believe this one is in the middle of their size range. They go up to US 22, 24, 26, 28, I cannot remember, but they are big girl friendly too. If she's not flowing, if she's stiff, then this is not essential. We're staying in the dress category because I'm excited about this dress. Like this dress is so cute, but I really gotta tailor it. This Cooper fabric is really nice and honestly feels good on the body. We just gotta tear this girl, okay? Not to be rude, but this is not a sundress. This is cute to wear during the day with sandals, running errands, and even around the house. Had this from 2021 and it really did last at me until this year. So home this sport really tells me how too deep into Karen land I am. This sport is literally a game changer. I could just wear this during the day. Errands, I could just throw on a t-shirt, throw on some sneakers and get to the stove. But honestly, we got to normalize wearing skirts more often. This one is a medium and since I'm short, I usually tuck in the top part of it and also to shorten the skirt to my liking as well. It does have a band right here. It has concealed pockets in the short area. So right here. I can also wear this to exercise. I call Miss Girl a multi-purpose piece, okay? But these right here are literally fire. I got these. Now Gianni Beanie makes the best heels ever. Most of their heels are usually made in Brazil or China. One of the things that I adore about the craftsmanship, not for all their shoes, but I really like the audacity to kind of conceal these right here. It makes it more comfortable to walk when you have like a little plastic thing and sometimes the little rough edges and sometimes they don't finish it. It could be a little bit painful on the feet. Added, I like the heel. It is more balanced. It's not straight on the back. Don't buy heels that are straight in the back. That's why y'all be stumbling in the club. Y'all be like, <laughs> and it's the heels. It's the heels y'all buying. Miss Girl, Miss Girl Benz, that is what you want. You don't want to be in a club and shoes are so stiff that it hurts your foot to walk in. But when it comes to this, it got a bend. So that way it can go along with your foot. So that way it keeps it secure and it also keeps it nice and in place. So that way you you will prevent any problems down the road. Take it from me, take it from me. They're a little beat up, but some of y'all are buying golden gooses that are beat up, that look beat up. So don't talk crap about my beat up shoes. I got these Nike blazers, but look, 
These are shoes that I will actually wear. I love shoes with a little platform and the sleek style that goes with most of the things in my wardrobe. These are really great whenever paired with my dresses for the day. I could just wear them with shorts. Now, I got a question for you. What are you excited to wear this spring? Go crazy in the comments. You give this video a thumbs up and like this video. And that's how you secure your spot in the Deluxe Club. But until then, I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye. Y'all have a blessed day.